So today I'm going to show you how to take a brand new external hard drive. We've got a Toshiba one terabyte external hard drive. Purchased it off Amazon. And I'm going to show you how to set up a MacBook Pro or any Mac with Time Machine. So the first thing we're going to do is take our brand new external hard drive. It comes with the cable. Go ahead and plug it in. After a few seconds, it's going to go ahead and come up. As you can see, the light's flashing and it just went on steady. Okay, it just recognized it. I had Time Machine already pulled up, but you didn't have to. You don't have to have Time Machine turned on or pulled up on the screen. It says, do you want to use this Toshiba external one terabyte um, as your backup for Time Machine? And you're going to say, use as backup disk. Are you sure you want to erase all the backup data? Absolutely. So what it's going to do, it's going to go ahead and format the external hard drive and it's going to create it, it's going to put it into a format that um, the Mac can handle. So you're going to say go ahead and erase because there's nothing on it and it's going to go ahead and run through the program and prep the disk. I'll let it run through and I'll be back in a minute. So I'm back. It just took about a minute. And as you can see, it pulled up Time Machine. It automatically turned it to on because it was on off. It shows that as the backup disk. And now it's automatically going to do backups. You can see you can go to the options and you can remove it. You can also add new ba backups to it. You can have it notify you when the old backups are deleted when it gets full. So when it gets full, it's going to save the newest and delete the oldest. You can also say, is it okay for it to back up on battery power? I'm going to say yes, but that's going to be a personal preference. So you didn't even need to go in there. Those are the defaults, but you can if you want to. So if you want to go ahead and have it back up right now, you go up to your top and you see this clock with the arrow. That's the backup. You can say, skip this backup, enter time machine. You can see it's already backing up. So I've got 200 gigs worth of data to back up. It's going to back up the whole PC and the, or the whole Mac and operating system and everything. So if I would ever have an issue where, let's say my, I lost my laptop, it got stolen, I would have all my data and never lose it. The nice thing about having one of these portable units is, let's say your house gets broken into, you can back it up and then you can put it in a desk drawer. So it keeps somebody from grabbing everything you've got and now they've got all your data and your computer. So I prefer this method just for that reason. And it's portable. So you go out of town, you're doing a bunch of work, you want to save it. You, you, it's easy to carry with you. And the Toshiba I like is because they make it in the aluminum finish. So it kind of matches, not that it matters, but you know, might as well. So as you can see, it's backing up. Now, every time I plug this in, it's automatically going to back up. I've also seen people leave it connected all the time. And if they don't move their computer a lot and it sits on a desk, there's no reason you can't do that. So that was my review. I, I, I think it's going to work out surprisingly well. It's very easy to set up. I applaud Mac and Toshiba. It, you don't have to do a Toshiba external hard drive. You can pick up any one as long as it says it's Mac compatible because it has to format it in that version. Thanks. Hope you enjoyed.